you know, children and playgrounds seem to always go together naturally. But there's some playground equipment that really isn't accessible to certain children. The city of Weston has put together a special playground that's universally accessible. And with us here is the Parks and Recreation Director for the city of Weston, Don Decker. Don, this is a great playground. Tell us a little bit about how it got started and what, what its purpose really is. Sure. Well, we've always been trying to identify equipment for children and actually for adults in our community to allow them to experience the playground uh, better. This equipment with the ramps allows somebody who would be in a wheelchair to be able to actually get on the equipment easily without having to transfer out of the chair. Some people with lower body disabilities might be able to crawl onto equipment, and all of our playground equipment in the city is designed for that purpose. But in this particular case, somebody in a wheelchair could actually roll right on and participate with the other children in a more comfortable environment. A parent who might have a disability as well could get on the equipment with a younger child and actually be there to supervise. So it really gives the most opportunity for everybody to participate. Uh, the, the floor that we're standing on here is also unique. Uh, tell us what this is all about. Sure, this is a poured in place rubber surfacing which is designed to help somebody in a wheelchair be able to come onto the playground surface and get around it without any type of obstacles. In addition, it's a softer surface so that somebody who might fall off the equipment would still be safe uh, and prevent most injuries as a result of that. What kind of feedback have you gotten from uh, parents and from kids who've been able to utilize this? Well, we've been very positive. First of all, all of our playgrounds that have not only the flooring but the shade covers the increase of, of, uh, of participation on those playgrounds has really grown as we've done that work throughout the city. Uh, not long after we opened this playground, about the second day I was here, we actually saw a parent in a wheelchair on the playground supervising their child. I didn't identify myself, myself as a city employee, but I overheard that parent saying, this is the first time I was able to come onto a playground with you, and you could see the genuine uh, heartfelt uh, feelings that that gentleman had. It was terrific. So uh, tell everybody who might not know where this is actually located and what the hours are of operation. Sure, we're in the Western Regional Park. This playground is adjacent to the community center right near the soccer fields. The park is open 7 a.m. to about 11 p.m. every day of the week. Excellent. So uh, if you uh, have a, a hankering to come out with your children to uh, get to a playground that's covered and has a soft floor and great accessibility for children regardless of their status, you can come to the Western Regional Park and enjoy this universal playground.